Howdy, X. Hey, Joe. How's it going? Great. I love your little um, your little stall over here. Looks very <laughs> fancy. Much nicer than mine. I'm gonna have to upgrade. You're 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 setting a high bar for the neighborhood already. And then you oh, come in. Thanks. And you got something else going up. What what is this gonna be? Can you say? Yeah, this is gonna be some uh, redstone <clears throat> for my shop. Oh gosh, mm -hmm. my voice. I apologize. Um, oh yeah, no problem. I, I kind of want to, like, I haven't revealed what uh, permit I got yet. I, I want to, like, create the goods on demand. So I'm going to have a little mm. redstone thing here where you can, like, buy, and then it, like, creates more of it. Oh. It's kind of wow. Kind of what I was thinking. So I ain't, got, I ain't got the time right now to, you know, build a big fancy shop. So I thought, mm -hmm. let's get it here. Let's start using it. And I'll just put scaffolding around it. <laughs> People on the server so, love scaffolding. I'm very impressed with the uh, nether... <laughs> Oh yeah, no, that was that's super convenient. That is though, because mm -hmm. we need like a temporary platform, right? Oh yeah, yeah. I'm. That's what scaffolding's for. <laughs> well, I'm excited to see what you come up with next. Yeah, I'm realizing I put a few bookshelves in the shop there, but having unsorted chiseled bookshelves with just random F tier books in it might not be a great long term strategy because there's no way to hover over them and see what's what. So I think yeah, I'm gonna you have to pull sort one out them. to see what it is. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna have to have like a separate row for each or something like that in the long term. For right now, I'm just jamming them in there and saying, I don't know, leave a diamond, but whatever. Let's see. Yeah. So like, fish it out. What one is it? Put it back in. You know what would be nice? I think is mm -hmm. if you had a chiseled bookshelf for each different book type, and it told you there was a sign, because then you would actually be going into a bookshop. Bookshop. Mm -hmm. and taking a book off the shelf. <laughs> you just need to know which one you got to pick. That's what I want to do. Ultimately, what I kind of was inspired most by was, you know in Decked Out 2, how Tango has all those alcoves for all the different hermits to set up? I was thinking, oh, yeah. what if I set up a like a row of alcoves that are themed around whatever the uh, benefit of the book is? Like Luck of the Sea would be like a fishing theme, and uh, Frostwalker would be an idea. ice theme. And so... You would have not only a sign that says Frostwalker, but you'd visually be able to see like, oh, the one with all the ice, that's the Frostwalker one. But uh, yeah, that's a little bit further along than like starter stall, you know? Yeah, no, that's a superb idea. I think uh, I think that's a good plan, you know? And it's something you can chip away at over time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I figured I wanted to let other people claim some land first. Let me use a bed real quick. Uh, but I wanted other people to kind of get some good uh, shops in before I start claiming a bunch of space for that bookshop because... Yeah, you know, I feel weird being like, okay, I'm going to claim a bunch of space all at once and nobody else, except for like you basically are even over here. Yeah, I felt a bit weird about doing that because I don't know, like, like, I feel like the, the permits have given us a little bit of a impetus to start working on stuff where maybe mm -hmm. we're not quite ready yet. Yeah, it's like some of the stuff I need to build my shop. I'm waiting for other people to open shops so that I can get, the, <laughs> like, I need a beacon. Yeah. But the beacon shop's not open yet, and I don't really feel like I'd have time to go kill a wither, so oh, you yeah. know, I'm kind of oh, yeah. stalled a little bit, but... Oh, well, getting, getting a... Uh, oh, wait, I, a... that was intentional. Stalled. Yeah, okay. uh -huh, the puns, the puns. Yeah. <laughs> if you want to get if you want to get a beacon, um, there's a wither farm in the Never. Oh, if you really? Pop down the stairs, mm -hmm. and then look behind it, there's like a free-by-free free opening in the Netherrack. Oh. Right, that's a tunnel. If you follow that tunnel, it'll take you to the Wither Farm, and the rates are really good. So you're you'll probably get you know there's beacons to protect you there and stuff. So you'll probably get like some skulls pretty quick if you want them. Oh, that sounds fantastic! I might do that. Thank you so much for the advice, X. No problem, Joe. No problem. Um, do we need golden armor? Yeah, we need to get golden armor. Oh, I have taken a random portal and come to the desert where there is a hole that drops straight down there. That looks super dangerous. There's no water at the bottom of that one. This one, though, has water at the bottom of it, and it's made of end stone. There's no signage on either of these, though. And down we go! Okay. So, what is this? Respawn the dragon, leave four end crystals. I don't know how to make an end crystal, so we probably shouldn't do that. Elytra hunting? Well, no, I'm not. Okay, I think we just want to go in here and visit the Ender Ender to try to make some books. So I think that this might be the Ender Ender here. I'm not sure how different we should expect it to be from last season. But if it still has a place with bookshelves, 
We've got our mending sword here. We can hopefully enchant some books and keep making progress. So we're going to on. Okay, and then enchanting and anvils is back here. Oh no, we're not going to be able to put string in here the way we did the other one. And we didn't bring the string. Uh, there might have been some poor thinking. There's no ender chest in here either. I was hoping I could pull additional lapis out of my ender chest, but... Okay. Let's just get a bunch of levels real quick, at least. So, six more books isn't bad, but it, it's not great. I think we're going to have to really refine our process here. I, I have not so thought this through yet, is what I'm realizing. Let's, uh... Regroup, rethink, and reapproach these problems. Time skip. <laughs> How's it going? Good. How are you? Good. I don't suppose you need any piercing or bane of arthropods books because I've got those for sale if you need them. Uh, not at the moment. Not at the moment. Those don't. <laughs> Hopefully, you uh, you make some money on that, huh? <laughs> yeah, I figured there's gonna be some random mini game at some point where somebody's like, "Oh man, yeah. I need fifty bane of arthropods books. What a pain." And then they'll yeah, just yeah. drop diamonds on me. But that's going to be kind of a late game investment. I don't think we're going to see that this week. But uh, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm sure just setting right. up temporary tents and stalls at this point, And I'll try and build something better in a month or two. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm in the same place. I'm going to build up. A, I'm going to put up a temporary spot for cherry wood right now. Mm. Uh, but I'm trying to wait. I'm trying to. Can we just set up anywhere around here? This kind of yeah, like yeah. For right pod. now, just yeah, grab a place and set up a stall is kind of how it's going. And then we'll bulldoze the stalls and build permanent stuff in you know in the next few weeks. Yeah, that sounds good. What's this over here? Who's what's this? That's one of Asuma's projects. He hasn't said what's going to go in there. Just that he's uh, getting started on it. All right. Can we go? I want to. What the? Oh. Hold on. Oh, no. Okay. Let me just. <laughs> there you go. My horse just. I didn't know horses could climb scaffolding. Apparently. Uh, all right. Very good. All right. I'm going to set up uh, something around here. Okay, cool. Well, feel free to bug me if you need anything. Ooh. Welcome, Vintage Beef, to the F tier book stall. I'm just setting up a little tent here. In the long term, I want to have just a magnificent cathedral to literacy. But for right now, this will hold us over, you know? Does the F stand for fantastic? I believe that fantasy is the heart of imagination. So, yes, gotcha. it is indeed the fantastic <laughs> tier book tent. I actually came because I heard there was already um, uh, a uh, an item or a name tag store. Oh, that's right next door. Yeah, let me show you. Come on Ooh, over. My name tag is, stall everything's... is right over oh, here. Oh, yeah. These are oh, lightly yeah. used. Lightly used. Uh, right here in this one. Perfect. Hi, my name is Joe Mills. Nice. Lightly used name tags and F tier books. One diamond each. One diamond. That's all I need for your name tag? Yep. That's all you need. What a savings. That's amazing. Yep. I didn't bring any diamonds with me. Oh, well, I unfortunately don't have the ability to make an ender chest yet, but there is one in the little mud hut kind of back that way. I don't even have an ender chest either. I have to go and get some diamonds. That's fair. I'll be here, Beef. You know you know when you go shopping and you forget your wallet at home? Or maybe mm -hmm. you're going out for a drive and you forget your, your wallet at home and you have no mm -hmm. license. Uh, Happens uh, yeah. all the time. It's not great. but <laughs> Not great. I'll be right back. <laughs> all right, what do you need, shortly. Beef? What do you need? What, what do you mean, need? what do I need? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What, 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 what are you, do you need? Are you, you need offering... Some, you trying I'm to sell name tags on my turf, Skizzleman? I just... <laughs> No, 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 no. He, it sounds like he's. You can pay me back. How many diamonds do you need? Right? Oh, now? just just one. I just need the one name tag. Just the one. You were gonna go all the way back to get that. Company. I was. Oh, look at what a gentleman. Wow. You want to make that track? Don't, hey, where brothers don't shake hands. Brothers go to hug. We're, you right. are, we're we're in the big salmon <laughs> together, man. Absolutely. Thanks a bunch, buddy. You uh, bet. Awesome. Joe? Yeah, I I would have been uh, oh. okay with loaning you a diamond, but this is literally the first diamond. I've really, <laughs> yeah, this is the first is this time the first sale. This is the first sale. I need to frame <gasps> this. I'm going to go over here to my anvil first sale. I'm going to take the one that says, hi, my name is Joe Hills. <laughs> go for it. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> this is amazing. All righty. First sale, vintage beef, February 26th. I'm going to frame oh. that. Woo. Oh, that's exciting. You don't I'm have so any uh, item frames, do you? I mean, I can make them. Don't worry. Okay. All right. All right. Well, I'm excited to see it. Display it proudly. Oh, I will. I will. Thank you so much, Beef. You really made my day. Yeah, nope. You made my day. And Skiz, you made mine also.
Skills making everyone's day from over the hill. That's not <laughs> an H joke. Singing. He's always got a jingle I, for everything. I love it. Don't ever change, Joe. Keep singing, buddy. <laughs> Will do. What's that right over there? According to Doc M77, that is the area that the log shop will go in. I need to go recover some of the copper that I left to age around the future home of the Hermit Homedell. Luckily, there's quite a bit of it. It might not be the half shulker that Doc is looking for, but I don't even have a shulker. So, you know, whatever. Let's head over there and see what we can grab now. Time skip. Here we are at the plot that Doc has designated for the future home of the Log Collective. I'm just going to put this contribution chest from Birch and Oak here. Unfortunately, I thought I had more copper than I did, but, well, we threw in what we could. Hopefully Doc has a way to get copper with some sort of magic farm or something. I'm sure we'll find out. Time skip. Welcome back to the shopping district. Time has passed, if you can't tell by my stylish new clothes, that I think communicate to others. There is a puppet who knows how to own more than one set of clothes. Um, yeah, there's a new building over there. What is that building? Looks like some sort of shop that sells swords. Let's see what kind of swords it sells. Oh, no, it sells item frames that contain swords. 16 item frames for one diamond. Wow. I think this was a mumbo build. I saw him over here the other day. I'm, I've been a little sick, so sorry if my voice sounds a bit off. But uh, yeah, so mumbo, I, th I saw working on this. I guess that's his. I don't really need item frames right now, but when I do, it's good to know they're ready. Isuma got his thing done. It looks like uh, I say done. It's still just a frame of bamboo and string scaffolds. But, you know, this... This is a complete thing of scaffolds, you know? Like, some people start something and then just walk away. But Asuma said, I'm going to make a playpen out of these scaffolds. And now, as a small child contained within it, I just look up and want to scream for orange juice. But that's okay. I'm not going to scream. Because some of you are wearing headphones. And that's that's a courtesy to you. <laughs> but this thing, I don't know. I, I like being in here. This is nice. This is like, I wonder if this is what cats feel when they climb into a cardboard box. Like, I don't know if you remember when you were a kid climbing into a little cabinet or something. And it's just like, this is nice. I see Beef and Doc are apparently also coordinating on that copper. Let's go ahead and see. Beef reminded me, you know, we've got our first sale to Beef, and it looks like we got our second sale here already. So, you know, that's that's pretty handy to have. I was thinking I might run and go put that in my ender chest. And when I say my ender chest, I think that the nearest ender chest might actually be in the mud shop over here. I'm not sure that there is a nearer ender chest. <laughs> Isuma's playpen didn't have one, but this one sure did. And you know what? I wanted to get out my oak and birch logs collective item here. I felt like that might be a good thing to have in my hot bar uh, before I go talk to Doc. So let's see. Uh, you know, I probably don't want to have, I feel like if I go talk to Doc with a loaded crossbow in hand, that's going to look offensive. So maybe I put that in the less aggressive offhand. Um, you know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe not. Whoop. Okay. Uh, I was going to try and eat the steak there. Okay, well, I've reloaded the crossbow. Maybe the crossbow is not a safe thing to have in the offhand. Maybe, maybe we're just going to accept that. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Wow, I thought I had set out a lot of copper to age, but it looks like Doc M77 is aging some copper himself. Doc, you around? Okay, well, I was hoping to bother Doc at whatever this thing is. But I don't see a good way up. I might need to go and grab some scaffolds from Asuma's large playpen here. 
Oh, hey, look beef. at this place. This place is looking interesting, to say the least. Yeah, it sure is oh, something. Hi. Doc, what's happening? Hey, Doc. Look at this thing. <laughs> wow, it's this happening. is extensive. Uh, yeah, <laughs> extensive this is, is a good way to describe it. just the, the base of it, pretty much. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, That's crazy. It's gonna, be, it's gonna be tall. Okay. <laughs> Well, yeah, um, you know, I, I understand not being super involved in all of the planning because I've been sick the last few days. I've been on bed rest. You know, I thought maybe I had missed a message from you or something about <laughs> all of this. Wait, and it, it, it doesn't seem like I did, uh, you know, inst no, no. It, instead, it, it seems like, you know, I'm getting, you know, messages from my viewers saying that you're running around claiming that you've got three uh, log permits mm -hmm. And, what? and I'm pretty sure that I've got one of them right here, Oak and yeah, Birch yeah. Logs. Well, so it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter though because you know I own them. No, I you mean. don't. Oh. You don't have the contract <laughs> between myself and my supplier, yeah. who I cannot name and is probably not you. Statistically speaking, it's yeah. very unlikely that you have any sort of sole supplier contract with me. Yeah. But my sole supplier does not have the right to have my voting proxy in any oh, log related matters boy. so interesting doc I, I don't, interesting I, you know i i need to be able to go and take a rest and give somebody my proxy when i'm sick but you know i don't think it's going to be you in the future since you seem to have absorbed <laughs> that responsibility for yourself yeah that's one side to look at it or <laughs> somebody is doing something while others are playing sick or riding around on donkeys oh, oh. Dude, playing I am sick. not All playing right. sick. I had to cancel two in-person appearances. I was supposed to perform at my well, sister's you know, birthday show in Nashville. Like, I had to cancel that. Yeah. I'm canceling my Tennessee Game Days event on Saturday and Sunday. Like, these are huge events that people were coming to see me at, and I had to cancel oh, them. Goodness. I am not playing sick, Doc. All right, so somebody is doing something while the others are sick and resting. I've been at it for the last four days at 20 hours a day chopping logs. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's all I am concerning. And This I'm is interesting, though. This is interesting. Well, you know, I was under the impression you had all the permits. I, I clearly see a permit right there. Yes, yeah. but it, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Hmm. I'm okay. not sure that it doesn't matter. <laughs> Yes, I mean, my cognition he, he, he is arguably fairly paper. impaired, but I am deeply <laughs> uncertain about how much it doesn't matter. <laughs> well, you, you're holding your permit in your hand, right? But you, you but have it in your heart. on paper, I own it. It's just a piece of paper. <laughs> Wait a minute. Like, I don't know? think that you do. I don't think that anyone yeah. owns this permit except the permit holder. Yeah, but it, I yeah, have not entered have into any of sort of... Paper. It, doesn't, it doesn't matter. What do you want to do with the piece of paper? I think I, what he's trying to say is the spirit of the permit is with him. <laughs> well, and the physicality yeah, of it. Know. Okay, so like I said, I I will admit I did enter into a sole supplier agreement with a hermit. But when Dell Computers gives Intel a sole supplier agreement for their processors, that does not mean that Intel owns Dell Computers. That just means that Intel is the sole supplier of processors for Dell computers. Yeah, but okay, okay, it's and all they can't go buy an ER. Talk, ER. What what is the point? What are you trying to? I think to the tell point me? is the point is that you have two wood permits, not three. Yes, yeah. I have one. Joe has one. Yes, and Skiz has one. And hmm, I don't know if you have the majority <laughs> of the wood permits anymore, Doc. Doesn't matter. You're gonna live in my house, so I call the shots. <laughs> I'm building it right now. <laughs> I mean, it is looking Christ, pretty cool. What are you, I'm like, interested I, to see what it looks like. But are you coming here to waste my time with, with <laughs> you know, with with like how you call it formalities? Oh, for <laughs> technicalities. <laughs> Technicalities, yeah. Well, I'm grinding for our for our glorious future to be the richest shop owners on the server. Hmm. I mean, here, here's the that thing. all you had. Huh? I, it doesn't make sense to me to give away the okay, rights Joe, to participate in things. Let's, let's include you so in I the very, very important decision we made yesterday when we met while you were sick. Are you okay with this plot? Mm, I might want to move it about 20 blocks that way. 
<laughs> Too late. I already moved it 20 blocks that yeah, way because but Green you know what? I kindly think, asked. Huh? Uh, when Green what? asked us to move it 20 blocks that way, I thought, you know what? Green worked so hard on all this. Maybe we should double down. Maybe we should I move we the should whole move... thing 40 blocks that way. Uh, I think we should move it 20 blocks back. <laughs> you yeah, know what? That's yeah, better. Yeah. Let's, yeah, let's, you know what? I'm, I'm tired of Green. Let's move it 20 blocks back. You're right. <laughs> let's go to war with Green. <laughs> Doc, you're doing great work here. Uh, but yes. I would just like to point out that uh, any decision making in the future, I don't know if you have a majority anymore. Just saying. But decisions about what? I uh, don't you know. know. If decisions need Anything. to be made, I want to be involved. Anything. Yeah. I, I If you had asked for my proxy, I might have given it to you, but I'm just offended that no one asked for my proxy and y'all met without me. So mm. please, if I can't then make you it, you can in the be future... offended at beef and skist uh, no, the same way. Wh oh, no. why you want to be offended at me only? You yeah, said like, you had all the other because you're the one that lied and said you had my proxy. You said you had you all three permits. I don't lie. I I had, did never say I had your proxy. I said I I own all the permits, which, which is I do. A lie. You want to read through the paperwork again? You want you want to read through the paperwork again? You give me oh, fifty percent. I did. Yeah, you give me fifty percent of your earnings, and I'm your sole supplier. Period. A sole supplier this, who gets a profit sharing agreement is not an owner of something, yeah. Doc. I, I, oh I, yes, because you agreed to selling it for sand, so I own you. You do what? Oh, you I dang. really don't think you understand dang. what a sole supplier agreement does. Well, I'm just gonna back out of this me. conversation. <laughs> sue me. Try to sue me. Then I like. I don't. You know. Like, what's the point? I'm building. What do you want? Okay. I'll, le I'll leave you to your building. All I want is to be involved next time you guys have a meeting. Yeah, you exactly. Were lying about having my vote. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. were sick. You had to cancel two in-person in appointments. And you didn't even <laughs> what, ask. Don't you for did you forget? You didn't even ask. What is he, a stand-up comedian? <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what Doc said. It was amazing. <laughs> um, okay, this is good. Yeah, what, this what is good is news. In-person performance, to me, immediately comes to mind. He's a, he's a stand-up comedian now. I don't know. <laughs> what are you doing in... like? What are you doing? Are you a singer? What are you performing? So <laughs> are you a singer? It actually it actually was uh partially a musical show. So my sister was this is like actually really what? detailed. But okay, so my sister for her birthday booked a music venue and was having a bunch of friends and family uh either do some sort of comedy <laughs> or poetry he's he's or done. music. No, I mean he's yeah, done. you don't care. You don't care. But what? in Nashville there's a lot of very talented people and so yeah. I was one of the well, people the that is, was Joe, announced as a performer. The point is, there's going to be lots of space down below this gigantic hourglass I'm making right now. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> it symbolizes it symbolizing the infinite amount of time I put into gathering these resources over the past four days. Mm. And mm -hmm. now, mm -hmm. I'm enjoying placing these blocks and creating something. Yeah, you're doing a great job of the blocks, I have to okay. say. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry for you know pretending. Uh, I don't. I don't. Pretending is there. So, okay, oh, somebody somebody needed uh, needed to take charge. <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> also, be generous and say bluffing instead of lying. What? How's that? What? Lying? You were bluffing. Bluffing. I'll, no, no. I'll give you he's, bluffing. He's bluffing. I'll give you bluffing because, in fairness, I was you, negotiating. You are correct. Yeah, in negotiation, sometimes you overstate your position, and it was kind of unfortunate that beef and skiz did not it did not occur to them to call you on that bluff so yeah. you're right they're we should not have seen all the permits we should have asked to see the permits yeah. i blame us however well, yeah, turn of I, events. all the time i had a, a, a the dye and uh, whatever what is it dye and flower permit in my hand waving it around you never doubted it this is oh. my problem <laughs> you know. interesting okay no no this is fine this is fine this uh -huh. is good i like I, Joe has a permit. This is all I'm saying. There's three permits out there, and you have two of them. Just say. Yeah, so yeah. in the future, any 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 decisions that need to be made, <laughs> we might have the majority, Doc. Well, and Big I'm... Salmon and friends. <laughs> and friends. I love that I'm plural <laughs> now. Yay! <laughs> but, yeah. <sighs> this is exciting. Exciting times. Oh, we'll let you God. get back to it, Doc. <laughs> Do you have any copper? Wait a minute. Now, while you're Wait. here. <laughs> He's going to shake you down for I copper. Need, yeah, now, okay. You want to you wanna be involved? Call some shots? Okay. Oh, there you go. Do you have a beacon yeah, that so, I can go so mine with? Off. We need copper. We need a lot of copper to build the shop. And I need exactly 48 sea lanterns. 
There you go. 48 uh, sea I can, lanterns specifically. I can do specifically. some mining. Do you have a, uh, what, what, a beacon I could borrow? Wait, what? Do you have your own pickaxe too? or like, uh, I do should, have a pickaxe. Should I craft one for you? I don't have a, like, yeah, well, I look well, like I mean, the beacon I, market? I'll, I'll, go, I'll, go kill, <laughs> I'll go kill some withers and I'll get back to you some copper after that, Dude, I, I was chopping wood for four days for 20 hours straight per day without I a beacon. Can't. You can go That's mine for the copper. Do I look like the beacon what market? What are we talking about? <laughs> Fine, I, I, I will go kill a wither. I'll do it myself. Clear, you want to go kill a wither with kill me? I have wither? no armor and Why? inappropriate you know, equipment. Do you have a fortune? Really, I don't. Do, do you have a fortune axe? Oh my gosh. A fortune axe? A fortune pickaxe. Uh, I got a silk touch pickaxe. I can silk touch some oh. copper for you. And I've got a, mm -hmm. I've got a, a looting sword because I was going to try and kill uh, some wither skeletons today to make a beacon. So, Wait, who's got they the beacon wave permit? wave around their permits and don't even have a looting pickaxe. Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah, like, because we're at the stage like the, where most you know, people are building the stalls. Guy, You're the one that decided to build this hourglass that was going to take you 80 hours in one week without asking us to come help you build it. Well, yeah, He's asking because now. He's you don't even have a fortune axe. What should I ask for? <laughs> like, hunt a beacon, make a beacon first. Uh, I Jesus might have some Christ. more. I might have some more copper for you, Doc. Possibly. Oh, you do really? Yeah, I might. I might. Not on me. I'll go get it in a bit. <laughs> okay. Yeah. What are you doing here, Cleo? Huh? I was just coming to talk about our agreement. <laughs> really, just what? Steve. Oh, you have. <laughs> Oh, d d make sure he didn't bluff to you. He lied. I mean, bluffed to Beef and Skiz about having... What are you oh, no, talking no, about? Lying to me. It's a different thing. Okay. He was uh... sick. I was speaking in his interest, and now he's trying to backstab me, coming at me, not even having a fortune pickaxe. <laughs> like, a fortune pickaxe is no real bearing on legal agreement. Oh, yes, stop. because... So... Yes. It, sh <laughs> it shows your progression. It shows how far you've come. You know yeah. how... how... I was watching documentaries about a dog show. It's called the the Westminster or something. <laughs> okay. And this corgi How that this won, happened? it was <laughs> completely <laughs> unjustified. <laughs> that boxer had a beautiful backline. Okay. That's... How dare you, Joe, not have a beautiful backline? I, I thought he was calling him a corgi. Up, I, I need a beautiful <laughs> backline. <laughs> You know, I've been working on my skin Dude. development process, and I didn't you know, draw a backline right on this one, you, and now before I'm Before you deserve to disturb my zen here while I was building, I was watching Jailbirds. That's how deep I sunk. That's the last thing that I was able to watch um, on Netflix, because, it, yeah, the grind was real. Anyways, what? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, what? <laughs> Just that's You're amazing. Oh, oh this God. was the best. <laughs> best interaction ever. <laughs> Anyways, what? <laughs> I, I, I even watched a documentary about the Kentucky Derby. About the freaking Kentucky Derby. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, it's so good. Oh, my God, this is brilliant. Oh, oh, okay. All right, we'll leave you to oh, it, Doc. I'm gonna go see if I have any 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 copper. That's right. <laughs> yeah, you should perform at my sister's and then I'll, next I'll go, birthday. <laughs> okay. I'll make sure my back line is in is in order when I get back there. <laughs> Find me some copper, please. Oh, okay, okay, can. please. Oh my gosh. Ah, I wasn't expecting that when I came over here. Hey, Doc. <laughs> Anyways, what? Uh. <laughs> I don't even know. That I can... was great. Oh. Hello, Joe. <laughs> okay. Uh, you all right? <laughs> he startled me. What was that giggle? <laughs> oh, sorry. I was, I was just, you had asked, like, I don't know where the stairs I are, so I was like... a present, Joe. <gasps> a present? <laughs> you might need... Oh, you're in Iron Arbor. Oh, you're going... Okay. It's fine. How hard can <laughs> it be? <laughs> I've been in this place. I know it's not fine. <laughs> really? Okay. Well, you I know. struggled in diamonds, so I'm letting you know that now. Well, the thing is, Doc says I need to go and... Doc says, you realize that's my bedrock while you're using their joke. I think that gives me an extra vote. Doc really doesn't understand how... He doesn't understand voting rights, no. Contracts. Let's be honest. Yeah. Where is... Like, I... I, I went across this way at some point, and okay. then it was... Okay, because last time I saw a 3x3 three three tunnel over here... And I had to give up because that I didn't might, have yeah. any gold on. So I was going to take you this way if you... I think this is possibly it. 
but uh, never be sure. It's fine. I don't know how to access it, but I'm sure we'll uh, find gas out. Gas behind you. That's okay. Okay. It's stone. I'm guessing there's Get only in. one cart. Go in. I'll walk. Are you sure? Y you're sick. I'm not. Okay. Also, like, we're assuming this isn't trapped. Oh, it's not trapped. Trust me. I, I, it's okay. fine. If I, one thing I learned from Super Hostile, it's always walk the rail line first. Mm-hmm. I remember. Okay. Hey, I got an achievement called a terrible fortress. Oh, there are piglins in here. This is bad. Well, be careful, Joe. Okay. Don't hit the piglins. Okay. Otherwise, it's bad. Understood. So, wait, what's the difference between the downstairs and the upstairs? Uh, not much. Okay, it looks like you were killed by a wither skeleton. So... Should we make a voice group? So, Cleo, do you need me to go up there and get... Oh, she can't hear me. She's not in the voice group yet. Do you want me to get your Hello. stuff? I mean... I don't think you're going to survive, but you can try. It's always fun. Okay. Wow, there's like three wither skeletons already. Mm-hmm. That's, that's a lot of wither skeletons. Yep. Okay, so... X seems to think the... the, uh, um... the beacons... are just a cure-all for everything. Yeah. What X doesn't remember is that he's got netherite armor on. Okay, so I killed five wither skeletons. Didn't get a helmet. Mm -hmm. um, you think there's more up there than that? In the area with your stuff? Uh, probably yeah, definitely. not. I'm gonna that try that and pull anymore. them down. Yep. Oh, good. This one's got an enchanted diamond sword. I wonder where it got that. Okay, so I got an enchanted oh, it's got diamond sword. Yeah, it's got a sharpness uh, sword. You know what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch to that sword. Oh, this one's got all your armor. Oh, this is actually a really effective way of doing this. <laughs> okay, I got a bunch <laughs> of your armor. Oh, one skelly okay. has an elytra on. There you go. Okay, so I just got to pull him down. Well, at least we know that's not despawning. Yeah, let me see if I can find him. There's like a pig man right up there too. Let me know if you've got any food, Joe. Okay, I see the wither skeleton with the elytra. I'm trying to get him pulled down. He's not dropping down on me. I do have food. Oh, hey, there you are. Do you want some I... of your armor back? Here, I'll... Uh, yeah, sure. Thank you. Uh, here is your diamond sword too if you want to run up there and try and get. I really don't. <laughs> uh, okay, here's some of your food. Here's your rockets. Thank you. Okay. So, I can try and pull that one down again, if you're ready. But yeah, I'm gonna I can, be... I can... Or, if you want... Okay. Yes, he's right there. Oh, he's dead. Oh, good job. I would have rather loot the corpse down here, but... There's a lot of blazes up there. But I'm gonna die at the I'm gonna die at the exit, Joe. That's the plan. <laughs> okay. So yeah, get to the exit here. Oh, I'm fine. Okay, cool. I was gonna say, does drinking water bottles get rid of fire? No. Because I got a lot of water bottles on me. Uh Okay. So right now we've got one with our skeleton skull. And it seems like this is maybe not a plan that we're geared up for properly. Maybe this is more of a chest plate than an elytra no, thing? No, this is fine. Okay. Well, I might be with it a bit. Yeah. Oh, bye. Bye-bye, train. <laughs> That's... Uh, let me see if I can bring it back. Slowly. Slowly. Yeah, don't Georgia. stand there. It's going to bounce me. Pigman. Okay. Okay. That's all right. I've got loads of diamonds. I can replace all that stuff. The only thing I couldn't replace was... The elytra. And we got that, so it's all cool. Yay, okay. 
Joe? Yeah. If you're insisting on doing this... And I'm just going to try and pull the Because I've decided one. that I am not capable. Okay. You can have the sword. Go for it. Oh, I mean, I've got a... I've got a looting sword. Yeah, but that one's got sharpness five on it, so... Yeah, but like... Okay, here's a second one. So, oh, that's fast. I Have mean, they upped the drop rates on those? No, I'm just exceptionally lucky at everything. Oh, yeah, your back tells me a different story. Yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, it, okay, how many people can, can fall and not be able to get off the floor for a half hour and not have it be a crisis? At no point was I like, oh, this is a crisis. I was just like, this could be bad if something else happened that I couldn't deal with. That would be a crisis. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm a relatively fortunate person. <laughs> okay. Oh, I got a pickaxe. Did I, did I give that to you? Here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The pickaxe. Is that? I, I have three up. I had three up there, so. A fortune three, one. Dang it, sorry, I had to rethrow. Oh, that. Uh, there we go. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, cool. That's cool. mine as well. Thank you. Okay, yeah, I think that was... So, will they spawn on the lowest level here or only the upper levels? They will spawn all the way through. There's, It's got decent spawn rates. Okay, so I'll just wait for um, another one to spawn to down here and then I'll try and pull him toward the door and not kill the pig man. Is that a I'm bad I'm going to go plan? before you die. Uh, and then, and I appreciate then you, have to you Joe. Me. I want you to know that. But, Bye, Cleo. Uh, I wasn't actually intending to do that. I was just intending <laughs> to try and get out of the way. So uh, <laughs> okay, that was very theatrical. It was. I I am very theatrical, but I didn't intend that bit. Okay. Okay. Don't die. I'm not gonna and by stop die. The <laughs> <laughs> and by die, I mean in Minecraft or in real life. Those are the two rules that you must follow, not dying. I'll see you later, Joe. <laughs> oh, the minecart track exists so you can easily leave the spawn radius and come back. Oh, I thought it was... I was like, why would he build a minecart track that doesn't go all the way back to spawn? Okay, that makes way more sense. So how long do we have to stay here? Do we stay here a long time, or do we just press the button immediately? Third Wither Skull, we're out. Let's go! Wither Skeletons. I've killed 13 Wither Skeletons. And I've got... Checks math. Three Skulls. So, yeah, you know... Just your basic one in four odds. I'm pretty good at this game. Cleo, 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 Cleo. I've come to put a diamond sword in your hand. I am running up these stairs. The RNG might not be fair, but I got three wither skulls and 13 kills. Some people might say that's luck. But I think that's not enough. It's clearly those Joe Hale skills. I don't know where Cleo is. Dang it. Cleo! Okay, I'm just going to leave this on her board here. Does that work? Does it show up? It doesn't like show up as an icon if I leave it in the crafter. Yeah, well... It does stay, though. Luckily, Scar has a wither fighting area he designated. What? Cleo says I can have it? Really? What? Okay, well, we gotta name that something great, like... Friendship Blade... 9001. Thank you, Cleo. Okay, wow. I'll take it. We're going to go bother Skiz, but I didn't want to scare him with my puppet face again, so I put this wither skull on. I'm sure that this is in no way more or less disconcerting. Oh, is the jacket covering part of my mouth? Oh, we got to fix that. That's that's a problem. Dang it. That was not how that... Not to, it, it's still fine if I'm, like, there. Uh, What's going on, man? Hey, not much. I was just uh, thinking I might go kill a wither. I've got a bunch of mountains I need to destroy anyway, so I was just going to punch a cave into one of them and uh, 
you know, summon the Wither in there with a bunch of iron golems and see how it turned out. Any interest in joining? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let me, uh, let's see. I got a decent bow and I have a, an okay sword. That's about okay. it. I have a good sword see. and iron armor and a crossbow with one arrow. So we're going to really have to hope the iron <laughs> golems do a good job here. I might. Have... Oh, you want you want the golems to do it? Okay, yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, we'll see how it goes. This is there's some optimism here. Oh, is this? Uh, wow, you've really upgraded. I love this. Uh, like, it has a real sense of parabolic <laughs> arc to it. Yeah, yeah. The, the physics aren't there. This thing. Would, I, I need to put some structure on it to make it actually look like it could stand there. I just haven't well, gotten around. No, to no, it. no, no, no. What I'm saying is the way you have the arc, it looks like a chain. It looks like a ah. belt. Like, like it looks like. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is how it would hang if it wasn't supported. Mm. That's actually really cool. I see what really you're cool. saying, yeah. All right, so we're, you want to go into here then? Yeah, I was thinking maybe we punch into here a little bit further and we start oh. spawning the, uh, oh, hey, immediately at, emeralds. Oh, the emeralds. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, well, now I wish I did bring my pick, but I did not. Well, I'm okay. stay with you and do I this. Mean, yeah, yeah, that's, that's actually helpful because I did not bring torches. I am... <laughs> <laughs> woefully underprepared but i want to i want to be like whoa fully underprepared you know what i mean um yeah, i got it so so we're gonna we're so gonna bring see it what back you're around seeing here, everybody joe and skiz together make about one normal person <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's what we're dealing we, we with we do our best uh okay <laughs> so i'm thinking about this oh gosh this is maybe Lava. not the best place to fight the wither. Oh my goodness gracious, that's a terrible idea. <laughs> okay, maybe let's, uh, let's pick it slightly. Mm -hmm. uh, let's. Uh, that's no good. Yeah, I wonder how big that is, is. Let me. Yeah, let me. Uh, I don't. I'm you not going to squeeze I got, I got a water bucket. No, no. no I, I, I want to kind of see how big this is. Like, if we go a little bit. Yeah, actually, yeah. Pour the water bucket in there, though. Actually, yeah, that's great. Yeah, yeah. Because okay. then we'll have. We don't need to dig down lower anyway, and this way the wither won't like end up in a massive pit we can't escape, or we can't... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, so what if we just go down there and we start spawning the iron golems in this pit? You can use the water bucket to take out the rest of the lava. This is okay. this is actually surprisingly go. working. Uh, okay. <laughs> you, gotta have, you need to have more faith in our ability, buddy. I know, I know. <laughs> Do we? Maybe we want to spawn the golems on the obsidian platform and we spawn the wither deeper in here? Uh, we could, does that make Here, sense? So my, yeah, it does. My, my concern is this, I think. So if we, if, when the wither beats the, go the golems, which I think he will, I think, okay. uh, he's going to get out. And if he gets out into open air, we're going to be cooked. We're never, it was like, we're never going to get him. Okay. So we need like a, uh, staggered set of defensive positions before we reach open air. Mm-hmm. Okay. I, I I think I'm just uh, you're right though you wanted to do all I'm saying is that like literally Tango just tried to use a wither to do excavating and it just went so bad for him yeah he was trying to steer the <laughs> wither in a certain direction though whereas I'm more it, it, true apathetic about it destroying a bunch of blocks yeah yeah that's fair that's fair <laughs> would it make sense for you to start spawning a bunch of golems in this hallway behind us here while sure. I mine forward? Whoops, sorry, I lost. The, I sure can. I picked up the carved sure pumpkins. Can. Here you go. Unless, but I think I think we're gonna want like a ton of golems around the area that you're gonna spawn the wither, right? Well, it'll initially like, blast so them right when it spawns, so we need to have them back a little bit at least. You th you think the initial blast would would kill them? I don't, I don't know. Like I said, I don't fight these things regularly. This is, I am, I am making this up as I go. And mm. I, I, this so, is, this is going to be, Hey, I did. I feel like here's the deal. Yeah. I hear, here's, here's, I want to be proven wrong, but mm. I feel like, like I, I needed to say my piece of this is very likely going to go very South and I'm fine with it, man. Okay. You want to destroy the mountain. That's good. But I'm saying if we get out on the ice and trying mm. to fight that wither in the open air on the ice, it's just going to be the wither. That's always here somewhere. That's what I think. But yeah. hey, let's prove me wrong, dude. Well, I, I mean, I, I'm not basing this on like expertise where I'm like, Oh, I know where the margin for error is. And we're going to ride that line. This is like, mm -hmm. Oh, how bad could it be? <laughs> yeah okay you know? so, okay so if you say keep digging deeper i'll keep digging deeper i'm i'm fine with that uh i would say let's go about let's go a minimum of five to ten blocks deeper and then let's go in i think you're getting in a good amount and then we'll and oh I yeah that's what i meant up, by deeper uh, was like deeper away from the entrance yeah oh yeah 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 okay keep going 
Yeah, because we're good. already under a lot of blocks, so I don't know that we need to add a lot of verticality here. Okay. But we have to also have to make sure that ultimately this hallway is a one wide because we don't want him coming out towards us. Or do you? Well, how we at least need him to reach the uh, area where the golems are. So maybe we need a one wide behind the golems. Yeah, 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 right? yeah. So maybe we start narrowing yeah. this like so. So you, yeah, yeah, yeah. So where do you where do you want the golems to be spawned in this room maybe, here? Maybe right here. Yeah, and then we'll make the it's because this is one wide. The golems won't go back out there either. Right. Okay. So how you want me? To, how many you want in here? I'll start making them. I mean, I was gonna make twenty five. Oh uh, my oh, goodness! Here's the other, other thirty five blocks of iron. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't. Okay. I, okay so this is <laughs> this is gonna be complete madness. It's great. Well, okay, well, okay. Like I said, All I don't right, really do know the then. margin for error here, so I'm just going for it. Yeah, this is gonna be uh, this is gonna be something special. That's for true. Yeah. Okay, am I doing this right? There we go. There's. Uh oh, uh oh, come dig this out. He's what, getting hurt. What'd you do? I don't have a pick. Oh, okay, I, he was sorry. He was stuck in the wall. I didn't mean okay, to do that. Okay, so sorry, buddy. Do you need me to make a bigger? Should this? Should we have like more of a large antechamber here? Maybe. I'm just gonna see. See, he's good there. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh, I am your papa. You do what I say. Yeah. All right. Let me see. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna start widening this by going around it, so I don't accidentally pickaxe them in the process. I think this might be enough golems. Am I crazy? I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna I, start. how many how many uh, pumpkins do you have left? I got sixteen. That sounds like sixteen too few to me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it does. So you want you do want me to make the rest of these? I mean, it made sense to me at the time. Like, I'm guessing we're not going to want to make them. <laughs> at the time. We're not going to want to make them during the wither fight, right? Like, if I spawn the wither <laughs> right now, true. would you say, Joe, that makes it harder or easier for me to keep making these iron golems? That's goals. true. That's true. I, I feel like it would just... be harder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. All right, I'm just going to keep going here then. Okay, I'm going to keep going out this way. There we go. So I've got and... all my best gear on me. I have so much confidence in this plan. And yes, my iron best gear, gear is a nearly broken iron leggings and iron chest plate. I've got one hit left on each of them. <laughs> what are we doing? With this? I like I said, I love bad ideas, and this oh, one oh, is so. Just why are we doing ear this? Ear. Okay, so uh, I went and I talked to Doc <laughs> earlier about. Apparently, he was bluffing about having more. Uh, what do you call those log permits than he had? And he was not happy. He was lying. He yes, uh, that's that's one way to say bluffing. Uh, apparently, despite being a famous <laughs> poker chip handler, you did not think to call his bluff. <laughs> I didn't. So I'm not going to say I, that's I, equally on you and Doc, but I... I that's fair. It, I'm not going to only blame Doc. Um, but yeah, he wasn't too happy about being called out and told me to go do something productive, like go find copper to help with the build. And, uh, which I'm in the process of doing, I just need to get a beacon so I can mine the copper. So, you know. Okay. I, so you, hold, let's pump the brakes for a second. You have a wood permit then, a log permit. Yeah, I have the oak and birch permit. Can you dig one of these up? God, I wish I brought a pick. Oh, sorry. You have the, oh, okay, so you're going to be joining us then. Yes. And so basically, well, I let Doc know if you guys uh, have any meetings in the future, quorum would be reached if I was there. You know? Yeah. Um, yeah, that's helpful. That's actually good. I Okay, good. Yeah, so, okay. <laughs> oh, that Doc, the I'm never going to believe anything he says again. I mean, you know, it, he's not going to always oh, wow. misrepresent the truth. But, okay, if you're ready for me, I'm going to put these three skulls down, right? It's it's go time, how, dude. How fast, how much time do I have to run after I put the third one down? Because I'm You running. have, like, a good, like, okay, ten seconds. Okay, yeah, there you go. Wait. <laughs> I can't even. I don't even know where Wait, I'm at. The exit's the... back this way. Here he comes. The exit's back this oh! way. Oh, I can't get through. Oh! You can do it. You oh can do it, boy. Okay. Oh boy. Okay, here we go. What uh, have we done? Oh, some just came up. I gotta log off. I'll, let me know how this goes. Oh yeah, yeah. You know what? My back hurts. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go to. Uh... Okay. I don't know where he's at. Um, oh, huh? Okay. I, I'm hearing him. Okay. Okay. Is he These come guys this are way? ambling. I'm seeing some ambling. I'm. I'm worried that he's already. He's already gone. Like, yeah. well, he's like, I can't see. He's like, he's oh, he's trying to get out, dude. I'm gonna go hit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot him. I'm gonna okay, shoot him. Go for it. And look at me, buddy. I got a crossbow. Yeah, baby. Oh, he's Ooh. like stuck. 
Oh, we need him to come this way, dude. Uh, he's gonna drop. He's about to drop, and then he's gonna be able to okay. hit you. Okay. He's get there. He goes. He's so, dropped. He's it's okay. time for melee. Now it's time for melee. Is he too tall to get, get through? The, is it too short? Oh, jump with me. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I gotta get out of my way. Hold on. I gotta eat. I need pork chop power. Okay. Oh. He, some of them are starting to get is, hurt. Uh, is he coming this way? I think maybe the ceiling's too low. Maybe the guys can't get to him. Okay, yeah, break out that ceiling then. Well, they're, they're not going to go for him. He needs to come for them. Well, yeah, probably. Uh, <sighs> okay, I'm trying to get okay. into the wall so I can get to the to break it. Okay, I'm just I'm trying to get unwithered here so I can get back in the fight here. Oh, I hate this. I hate being withered. Hurry up! Okay, okay. So the ceiling is Pork broken enough they can. Okay, they're attacking. There go. Are they good? Good. Well, good. One of them is. Yeah, they're. You're right. There it goes. Okay, so Come on, we, go get we, him, guys! Get him, guys! If we can get him yeah, back baby. into this room here. Let me, I'm gonna widen the hallway. Oh, they're gonna get him, dude! Joe, well done. Uh, uh, you say that, you say that. <laughs> Why did I say that? Go get him, fellas! Okay. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Woo. I was widening Remember, it. he repairs himself. Oh, Woo. he does? That's... Oh, there they go. Yeah, get him! Get him! Okay, so that clearly yes! required all 25 of these. Our All right. perfect calculation. <laughs> oh, Joe, it worked. I'm so happy. Woo. Okay, okay, we're here. So this, I have it. A, uh, I have it. Oh, you got the thing? I have it. Okay. I'll give it to you, yeah. Awesome. Uh, my inventory is full of garbage, but... Uh, yeah, Look you got these the... Poor guys. Let, set, set these guys free. Guys, where are, you, are they withered? Oh, they're withered. Yeah, they're Never withered. Mind. They're withered. <laughs> They'll recover. And you know what? There's probably a bunch of monsters in this cave back here. I think this is an actual cave. Not just something that spawned from oh, the explosion. Oh, maybe he, like, focused on them for a second. I don't know. Okay, let me but, give uh, you this before I forget. Take this, buddy. Good work, man. Woo. First <laughs> nether star on season 10. Woo. Dude, that's good stuff, man. Okay, I stand corrected. I uh, How did we pull that off and Tango couldn't? I'm, t well, I'm taking that one with me. But like I said, it's all about <laughs> intent. Tango was trying to steer the thing. I was just yeah. trying to... Oh, look, look, look. What's this on the ground here, Doc? I'm gathering copper. I'm doing exactly <laughs> the task I'm supposed to be doing with no wasted steps. <laughs> oh, Tango did do two. He did two withers. Oh, okay. Well, that'll that, that might yeah. be a little bit harder. That is too funny, man. Now we got all... All right. Well done, man. Woo. Thank you all so right. much for the help, Skiz. Of course. Let's see. Oh, let me give you your... Well, I don't have much left, but let me give you this and this and this and potion and you had some stone. Oh, yeah. I was going to say, like, yeah. I, I, I'm throwing stone out of my inventory to pick up the other stuff you're throwing at me. That's fantastic. <laughs> it's all fun. right. I'm taking this wither rose. Yeah, yeah. Um, uh, yo, yeah. You're welcome right. to it. You want me to take you back by boat? I think ju I just got to shoot towards the sun. We should be good, right? Uh, are you yeah. good? Are you? Oh, you don't yeah. need to be here anymore? Let, okay. No, I mean, I'll get you back to the portal. That sounds good. So, I'll, also, I need to go get more uh, iron from Hypno because I, I need like another hundred. Whoa, for the uh, what do you call it? The uh, beacon platform. Okay, okay. All but right, yeah. good work, dude. Awesome. Yeah. So here's the portal. I'll catch you later, man. Thank you so much. Uh, you bet, brother. Take it easy, man. Whew. I have sent False Ren and anybody else who needs to fight the Wither the coordinates for that Iron Golem pit. And it looks like Doc is getting into a bit of more wheeling and dealing himself. Now all we need to do is make this beacon. So let's figure that out. Beacon. Hey, we figured that out. That was far easier than I expected. Okay, wow. Glad I recorded that moment. <laughs> okay, look at this inventory. This is the inventory of a successful hermit, let me tell you. We're going to take this beacon. We're going to plunk it down here. I was going to say, it should be open to the sky, right? Yeah, there it is. Boom. You know, we could even, like, assign some sort of secondary power or something. Boom. Like, haste two. If we bothered to actually, you know, unpack this second block of iron here. And go boop. Wait, no. I want these. Yeah. Look at that. I'll be mining copper in no time. Is there any copper here? That would be super handy. It, it would make me look way more competent. Competent? 
I don't know. It'd make me look great if there was just like a huge vein of copper right here. There's not. But you know what? That's fine. We chose this area because we needed to terraform it anyway for our build. I'll probably get some temporary storage to capture all these blocks and whatever. But you know what I didn't have to do today? Was capture your attention with ads. This episode was pre-roll ad free. Thanks to Patreon sponsor, Mr. Lance. Thanks, Mr. Lance. And it was also mid-roll ad free. Thanks to Patreon sponsor, Monate. So in lieu of that mid-roll ad, I will now read a haiku of my own devising. Charcoal grill dust smells like the skulls I ground away just past all the tracks. Until next time, y'all, this is Joe Hills from Nashville, Tennessee. Keep adventuring.